Good morning, East Texas. I'm Tom Mitzoff, and this is the TylerPaper.com Morning News Update. The end of an era at the post office may be near. Starting in August, the U.S. Postal Service will end Saturday home delivery of letters and other first-class mail, but will still deliver packages. The U.S. Postal Service says it's cutting most mail delivery for that day. The financially strapped service has been hinting at this for years and says going to five days a week will save it about $2 billion. It's expected to end the delivery in August, though those with post office boxes will still get service on Saturday. But while regular mail will stop then, carriers will still deliver packages on Saturday. Package delivery has been one of the few boons for the agency, with an increase in that service in recent years. The Postmaster General made that announcement this morning. The Postal Service lost $16 billion last year. They have already slashed hours and trimmed the workforce by 35%. The Scotty Dog has a new nemesis in Monopoly. Fans voted in an online contest to add a cat token to the property trading game, re replacing the iron. So we just completed the Monopoly Save Your Token campaign where we allowed fans to vote for which token they wanted to save in the game and which new token they wanted to bring into the game. It went great. It went great. We had fans in over 120 countries vote, um, which was very exciting. Lots of passionate fans of Monopoly. And um, we have a new winner, a new token on the board. Uh, the new winner is our new token, the cat. Uh, we welcome the cat to the Monopoly game, to the Monopoly family. And um, we had fans from all over the world reach out and vote for that token. Um, they love the cat and they feel like it's a great addition to the family. I'm sad to see the iron go. Personally, I'm a big fan of the race car, so I'm very relieved it was saved, uh, but it's sad to see the iron go. And our fans have, are very passionate about their tokens, about which token they use while they play. The results were announced after the shoe, wheelbarrow, and iron were neck and neck in the final hours of voting that sparked passionate efforts by fans to save their favorite tokens and businesses eager to capitalize on publicity surrounding the pieces that represent their products. The vote on Facebook closed just before midnight on Tuesday, marking the first time fans have had a say on which of the eight tokens to add and which one to toss. You may have been among the loyal viewers of The Bachelor TV show who were shocked that Sean sent Selma home last night. Selma seemed to have been one of his favorites in the earlier rounds, but People.com this morning published Sean's blog, which reveals his reasons for keeping the needy tiara over the sultry Selma. Sean wrote that it bothered him that Selma didn't even consider jumping into a frozen lake along with everybody else. He wrote he didn't like that inflexible attitude and that it didn't bode well for a marriage where people could work together and compromise. And now you know. Thanks for watching and look for our midday update around the noon hour.